tell me. I can't see. This has been my bed for the last like, four days for no reason because I have another bed. Okay, let's get my life together. Guys, you know that I'm getting my life together if I start journaling. I'm gonna sit here and journal and then we're gonna clean and we're gonna get some stuff done. Okay guys, it's a little bit later. I got dressed. I did my makeup. I need to curl my hair a little bit because it's kind of wild, but this top's from White Box. These are from Urban. I was FaceTiming Delilah, that's why I didn't film me doing all this. But I feel so much better. I'm clean, I've journaled. My hand kind of hurts from how much I journaled. And I'm feeling good. And now I just need to clean my space. I need to go see my family and then I'm gonna feel a million times better and then maybe like a cute little drive or something that puts the world into perspective and that we're on a floating rock would be kind of nice. Okay, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. Let me put, no, I was gonna put jewelry on, but I'm gonna do that in a second. Also, I've had coffee and on my mouth. I don't like that taste. So I'm gonna have to brush my teeth again. But let's do the dishes. And I kinda wanna talk while I do it. I'm in a talking mood. Try to bring my little trusty tripod over. It is time to do the dishes. It's time to run the dishwasher too. Ready to get back to vlogging. I kind of hate the fact that I haven't in like four days. I just, that's all. I just hate that. And I really want to be consistent about this. And I was not. And that's okay, because it's okay. I started because I just needed a break. And then after that, I just got kind of like lazy. I need to read, guys, I'm actually excited. I feel like I needed something to like be into shape to like actually like do this. Cause I feel like it's just kind of been so apartment oriented that I like haven't been, oh, I just splashed everywhere. But I haven't really been like be anything out of my comfort zone. Like I just kind of been staying here and I want to do some stuff by myself. I like went to the grocery store by myself the other day and it was really scary, but fun. And I'm just, you get it, you get it, you get it. You've been here, you've been in one of these moods. I want to explore more stuff here. Like we should go on a walk. I'm saying all this, but even though I kind of already have my day a little bit planned because I do want to go and see my family. Like, I'm in such a mood, it's so funny. Maybe tomorrow I'll go and watch the sunset or something. Like that could be fun. Like I'm excited to like do stuff like that. I don't know why I like, I'm just now thinking of doing all this. I have been pretty good at keeping this place clean. I did have people over for the first time. We came here before we went out, had like one, two, three, four people. But surprisingly, it actually didn't get that dirty. I've been really good at cleaning this place as much as I can. All right, Oop, you hit your head, I'm so sorry. Let's clean up this space. I'll show you what it looks like. It should not take me long. This is what I need to clean up. Should be very easy. Honestly, I'm probably done with the coffee. Yeah. Tan a little bit, even though I just put makeup on, it might be good that I have some protection, but it's, I think it's only like a five today, which is so good, but yeah, all this does not belong in here. So I'm gonna go run and put this in another room so I can clean that up. I'll be back. Also, I never showed you guys, I got this plan. I hide my microwave and the cord from when you first walk in, and I love it. Look how cute that is. This counter needs to be wiped out. Like, this is like the dirtiest it's gotten. This, like this thing, I have not let it get this bad, but I also haven't had people over. Also, super exciting, Avia, Delilah, and I are actually going to Disney this week. That's something I'm looking forward to. My like, little thing spilled somehow. So now, I also filmed the other day of me organizing my laundry room, but I, I didn't ever end up filming anything after that. We're getting our lives together. That's done. Ta-da. I organized all this. I got one of these and I built it. I'm gonna get bins to put it in so it's not just like out like that. My one ibuprofen, I need to get like actual like medicine, but I've got some sheets and stuff, my laundry. I'm not sure why there's a towel in there. I'm guessing that might've been Delilah. Um, my vacuum, I'm gonna get a little thing here that I can hang all that up on just so it's off the floor. Some bags, paper towels, toilet paper. Yeah. Now I'm going to straighten this up. There's not much I can do with it, but I'm gonna like fold the blankets and make it better. Probably need to wash this because I feel like I've slept on this more than I've slept on. My bad. I'm gonna feel so much better after this. How do you know Delilah's thing? 
over as if the guitar is out. You're gonna see the only thing I know to play. So much pressure. because I do it so much. <laughs> I can't. Okay, so I can't do it with my eyes closed, but I can do it with my eyes open. Guys, yesterday, actually, crazy story. With Delilah to go and help her get gas, because she left like late at night and we did not want her to buy herself. So I went with her, but when she dropped me off, I like had to walk up by myself. So when I'm like walking up, she like calls me and I didn't notice at the time it was because she wanted to make sure I got up. And I said like that got up. So she called me and I'm like walking and I like just got the phone. I was like hi and when you like go into my apartment like there's like this turn that like is like down like I don't know, like give you guys directions but it's like there's like a turn okay so you turn down a street it's not really an alley but it's like it's not not an alley, okay? <laughs> She's calling me and I'm really being aware of my surroundings, whatever. So I've never turned this turn and there been someone there, okay? Ever. And if they are, they're all the way like down there like, on the phone or something, or like I have time. But I'm walking and because I had like just answered the phone, I wasn't really like, whatever. I'm like walking and I turn and I swear to God, I think the reason why it spooked me so bad is because it wasn't like I turned and there was someone even three feet from me. I turned and bro, I turned and there was this man sit, like crouched down, like not sitting, like crouched like on his feet, crouched down, eating something. And I, oh my God, I like turned and he was like, I, could, I, I was gonna like trip over him because he like, I turned the corner and he was like right there and it's nighttime. And I freaked out like like I I like my whole body went into like shock like a whole shiver down my spine. I literally go I was like oh my I was like cousin he was like oh my god like he scared me so bad like I, right like I could sense like right as I turned and I got scared and I went oh my god I could tell that he wasn't like a threat to me for some reason even though he was a man crouched down in the middle of the night like, eating food I I don't know what he was doing but. At first, I realized that, like, I don't know, he looked at me in some sort of way that I was like, okay, I'm fine. Like, I had blood on the phone in my front door. was, like, right there. And then I realized I was fine, but I, like, couldn't stop talking, and I couldn't stop being scared. Like, I kept being like, oh, my God, like, oh, my God, like, you scared me so bad. And I'm, like, on the phone with Delilah, and Delilah's overhearing this. And Delilah's like, what just happened? I was like, sorry, this guy scared me so bad. And I, I think he, he felt bad. So he was like, I'm so sorry. I was like, no, you're okay. It's not your fault. But, bro, I have never been... I... I don't know, like, I feel like I've been in scary situations and like, I don't normally, I think he just caught me so off guard because it was like, I had like, I turned and not only was there someone in front of me, he was like looking up at me, like, like from like literally right here. Like, also let me, let me add, he had like a beanie on and a black hoodie and he was wearing black pants. So he, it was just like a ball of like crouching on eating and then he was looking up at me and I was just, I was already being aware of my surroundings so I already was like, they're like scaring myself like there's gonna be some, and then there was bro, but here's what even the worst part I was like, oh my god, like you scared me so bad and I don't, I'm not very vocal like that I don't, I, I don't know, but I was telling this man I was like, you scared me and I think uh, my phone like cut off because I was in the elevator so I was like, fine, I'm living life and then I'm like, I get back into my apartment and I'm like, I called Delilah back so I'm like, let's make sure that she's okay. She was like, bro, I turned around, I called you six times because it cut off right as I asked if he was following you. And it was like, so bad. All right, how here is clean. Let me just make sure. Uh, I think that this is good. I need to wash the sheet. There's literal crumbs on it because Delilah and I were like snacking yesterday. We ate like two whole bags of chips. So there's a lot of crumbs on there, but breath. I don't know, I think that storytelling took a lot out of me. We're going to my room, let's go. This is my room right now because I finally got like ready for something here. Let's make the bed and then I'll deal with the clothes. Done with the 
hanging clothes. Now I've got to do folding clothes in my other, in my closet room and then my bathroom. And then my apartment is clean. Come with me. Okay, well that was easy. We're doing my bathroom. This is the before. Okay, there's a bunch of people getting ready here. Leave me alone. Got to hang all that up. Oops. I mean, I need to wipe down the counters and like, clean the sink and all of that fun stuff, but that will be another day. <laughs> so exciting, I feel so good, okay. Oh wait, I forgot to put that away. Sorry, that probably wasn't satisfying because there was one more thing left on the counter. Let's FaceTime my family. It's time. Normally Sunday resets are like, oh, let's go to the grocery store, oh, let's do this. My Sunday reset is to go and hang out with my mom. What are you guys doing? Well, what are you doing? Should we all hang out? Yes, we all. Oh my gosh, yes. Bye bye. Bye. Done, done. So excited. I'm a little bit hungry and I'm debating on if I should eat here or if I should eat at my mom's. But I think I'm just gonna eat there because I really just wanna be there. But I feel a lot better physically because I showered and my space is clean. Let me just look so I can get another boost of serotonin. Yeah, I feel good. I feel a little bit weird mentally and I still don't really know why. Sorry, I also didn't curl my hair, so it's a little bit crazy and kind of bothering me. But I don't know, like I think I need to go to the beach or something, like something. Maybe tomorrow I'll go to the beach by myself. That could be really fun. We will see. Today, let's go snuggle with my puppies that I've not seen in so long and spend some time with my family. Let's head over. I'm home, I'm with my family. We need his bacon for food, but he's a baby girl. Oh my goodness, I went for a lot. We are about to watch a little documentary together. I fixed a little egg bagel. And that's the update. We're all just hanging out, doing our thing. We're planning a beach day too. It's been probably like an hour and a half. And I'm still in the same position as I was. And now we're trying to decide what we want to do for the rest of the day. But that's just an update. Look, at Gigi's butt is in her face. Look at us out of the house. I mean, might not be the best decision of our lives because there is a storm coming and it just started raining and we're like, let's go run some errands. Could not, might not be good, but we're gonna go to Target because I have two gift cards and then possibly, well, actually swap, or swap. Do you just <laughs> shut up? <laughs> we're gonna go to Ulta and then possibly Target because I have two gift cards. But we might not go to either because <gasps> I got a plant. Did I tell you oh, that? I thought you said I got a plant. No, a plant. A bonsai. No, Andre. I got a big plant. Really? A big tall plant. For what? For did you hurt yourself? I hurt myself. <laughs> Cover my microwave in the cords. Yes, you had to set It's big and cute. Is it real or fake? Fake. So you are telling me right now you're, you're, what's the word I'm looking for? I don't know. You are admitting. Yes. There's another word that I was going for. You're admitting that you went to Hobby Lobby without me? How'd you know it was Hobby Lobby? Because you've been talking about going to Hobby Lobby. Yes. Anyway. Confessing. Confessing. That's the other word that I was looking okay, for. I'm, I don't like that it's rainy. This is not what I wanted. It's sprinkling right no, now. No, but it's like overcast and it's not fun. My like, ears are ringing. The phone. <laughs> the phone is ringing. Okay, we're gonna go run some. <laughs> Have we just not been here on a Sunday in forever? All the, all the buggies are gone. Feeling? Yeah, no, it feels like the apocalypse. Like, it feels like people are scavenging for things. It is, it does. It kind of cleared out, though. Like, where did everyone we found go? found buggy. The buggy. Everything always works out for us. We also realized in finding the buggy that there's Pizza Hut pizza over there. Everything is good. Oh, never mind. Hold on. Everyone is back. <laughs> right there at that moment. We were looking and looking. I, I'm into the raspberry rose poppies. We're like, oh, they're normally right here. I guess they don't have any. I looked down. We're all the way back there. Normally, they don't even have those in them in a package normally they're like one you can only get one at a time this is insane hold on can i even reach it yeah i can this is so exciting also update i don't even know what happened <laughs> don't even don't even ask me got some flowers let's just not forget it's in there 
That's gonna be fun to carry. Are you closing it? Our phones. <laughs> Oh, I'm so back. It's hot in here because I turned off the air and I haven't put it back on. And I also just carried a bunch of bags up in my arm. I feel like I've got like huge muscles. I don't. <laughs> Embarrassing, okay. Some Sundays need to just be chilled out and just clean and do nothing. And that's what we did, even though we did run errands too. But let me show you guys what I got today. It's actually been perfect for me. I needed to just clear my brain. And tomorrow I think I'm gonna go to a cafe and edit because normally well, not normally, I haven't done that in the last like four days, but I was editing just like in my bed or like on the air mattress like right as I woke up and then my morning wouldn't really start until like noon it. And I don't like that. So tomorrow I have a meeting because it's Monday at a cute little cafe. I think with my mom, I'm gonna edit at the cafe and possibly go see the sunset at the beach. That's a plan that no one else knows about besides that what's in my head. I've not told anyone that. While and I were here, we just snacked and snacked and snacked. So I had to pick up some more ruffles because we went through a whole bag. <laughs> I picked up some, um, Boom, pick a pop, but it's like the kettle corn one. Because I've noticed I have a very like chocolatey sweet tooth. And the only chocolate that I had in here was like Nutella. And then I had a Reese's peanut butter cup, like one. And I saw myself not wanting to reach for it because I only had one. So I got myself some like, you know, salty. This is sweet and salty. When I do a Sunday reset, which I'm gonna like try to incorporate more of, I'm going to probably go to the grocery store. It just, it, I can tell it was not in me today. It was not what I wanted to do. Oh, somebody just commented, where are you on one of my YouTube videos? Because I haven't posted. I promise I'm coming. I restocked these. I restocked some of my favorite poppies. And then, oh, I brought over, these actually fell out. I was in, see they're like everywhere. I was in the garage and I like opened my passenger door to like grab more things to bring up. And my, all, it's like in a show when a girl like drops all of her like books and stuff and the guy like comes and like helps her but no no guy came and helped me so i just had to pick it up by myself anyway i've got some um pencils don't have any here so now when i want to journal i don't have to do it in sharpie and then oh from target i also got this pillow for my room it's got like almost like cheetah print type of texture on it it's kind of like polka dot okay Done with putting all of that stuff away. It did not take me long. Um, I will see you guys tomorrow. The question of the day, it won't be a question. It will be comment down below three fun facts about you. Facts about me is I lived in Japan when I was like two. So I don't remember it. So don't ask me any questions. But I did live there for like six months. Was a level nine gymnast. I don't know why this popped into my head. This is not what I would say on a normal, regular, daily basis, but I owned a horse. Hey guys, thank you for watching. Hopefully, this motivated you in some way. Let's have a fun day tomorrow because that's what I'm gonna see you next. Mwah. Okay, love you. Bye.